Hey guys, so um, I wanted to pick up on this on my videos. Um, I know I've been posting it. I'm super duper sorry about that. Um, it's been super busy for me right now. Hmm. I don't. This camera is not working. So I'll have to face it this way for now. I'm trying to stack everything so I can make a good angle. Hmm. I have a couple boxes over here. Um, so I've been trying to live stream and do all that fun stuff. It's just been... Oh, that's going to fall. Is that better? Okay. So today we're going to be starting a book. And then I have a couple announcements after. I'm super duper excited about it. So make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. And stay for the whole video, please. Please don't skip to the end. And comment down below, what is your favorite page of this book so far this is called emma is on the air showtime and it's by ida siegel i think i'm saying that right. I don't know. written and illustrated by ida siegel so i'm going to be doing one and two chapter one and two well maybe just one we'll see chapter one and i'll show you the page this is the coolest thing ever, Gabriel yelled with excitement. Sat down next to him on the floor of his living room and nodded in agreement. It was... Uh, I forgot. Uh, it was cool. Magnified glass check. Binoculars check. Javier pointed to each of the tools. Then came his brand new spy kit. Walkie talkies, check. Night vision goggles, check. It's all here. Awesome. Yeah. I'm going to need something to hold this up, you guys. So. Sorry for my bad camera angles here. Okay. Trying my best. No. All right, you know what? Oh, indeed. One, no, no hands to read. I know what you're thinking. We lost the costume contest at the Halloween festival. So how did JB get his spy kit? His parents got it for him. JB's parents told us all, all, all of us that they were proud. They, they were proud of him for doing something. Do something constructive, like being part of a reporting team and working hard to sell classes. So they decided to buy him a spiding kit as a reward. Hey, look, Sophia said, pointing. It also has a flashlight and a detective badge. And it's going to help solve even more mysteries, I added. Thanks, guys, JB said as he put the night vision goggles on his head. I don't get it. What's so great about a spy kit? asked Shakira. She was with us at Javier's house because afterward we were going to walk to a dance class together. Here's the picture. Spy kits are awesome, Javier, Javier answered. There's so much you can do. Look! These are night vision goggles. Watch this, JB turned off the lights in his living room. Hey, his mother yelled from the hallway. Who turned out the lights? Whoa, JB chuckled as he looked around the room. I can't see everything. I can read what's on the chalkboard in the kitchen. This is awesome. I don't know why I gave his mom a sudden accent, but maybe he's, maybe he's part southern. Maybe he's seven. Then the lights came back on. Shaver's mother took the glasses off and lightly bonked him on the head with them. No night vision in the living room, please. The rest of us can trip and fall. Sorry, Mom, Shaver answered. But he was all still smiling as his mom went back to the kitchen. Look! Emma, 
Shakira said as she stepped over Javier's spy kit. I found this headband for you, and it has a purple flower on top. I'll go, that would go great with your green blazer. Stop playing with your curls and try it on. Shakira isn't interested in spy stuff. She would much rather collect jewelry, work on different hairstyles, and put on lip gloss. In fact, Shakira has been helping me figure out news to report her hairstyles, especially ones that make sure my curls don't fall on my face when I'm trying to explain a story on the show. Emma is on air, and it's true. I was playing my with my pudding. Stinky curls. I like to pull them and watch them spring back up, especially when I'm thinking about stuff. I pulled my last curl all the way down. As far as I could tell, as far as I could, and then I let go and watched it bounce up to my head. Ha! I've had bounce, I have the bounciest curls. Thanks, Shakira, I said, as I took the headband off from her. You can use my new mirror, Shakira offered. She has gotten, here, she had gotten a new vanity kit for her birthday. Every time I open the mirror, it plays music and silly voice goes. You look fabulous. Shakira loves stuff like that. Her new vanity, vanity, vanity kit is full of hair ties and makeup and lip gloss. Alright guys, so I'm, I'm I'm having trouble like reading while the camera is not like facing towards that. So I will show you guys the picture I'm reading. Two. My mom says I'm not allowed to have make, wear makeup yet. At first, I was mad about it, but to be honest, I got over it. I like stalling, sol solving mysteries much more than wearing makeup anyways. Shakira, I really like this headband. I told her. Thank you. No problem. You look fabulous, she replied, sounding just like the swinging mirror. We all laughed as Javier's mom walked back into the living room. Emma, your mom is here to walk you girls to dance class, she told us. Okay, thanks, I answered. See you later, Javier, Sophia said. But Javier was so busy Playing with the spy kit, he was just, he just not, like, he nodded and mumbled a quick goodbye. We are learning a special kind of dance in our class. It's called the Dominican Republic, and it's, it's from the Dominican Republic, and it's called the Mongolia or something. Mongolia or something. The best part of Mongolia. <laughs> Sorry that I keep saying something. The best part of Magnolia, I'm just going to say that, dance is that all of us girls get to wear a big, beautiful dress. Du dresses. <laughs> I can't focus. They really have long, flowery, flowy skirts that are red, white, and blue. Sophia, Shakira, and I changed into our magnolia skirts as soon as we got into our dance studio. Okay, girlies, I want to spin around and move your hips so we could see the colorful skirts twirl in the air, said Mr. Soto. I'm really sorry if I say the name so. After we began our class, she's our dance teacher. Mastrosa, I'm just going to say, is how you say teacher in Spanish. You can say it like this. My estra. Pick up the sides of your shirt. I mean. Ah, skirts with your hands. Now twirl and hold up the skirt as high as you can. Oh my god. There's not much pictures. Yeah, there's one on the next page. Oh, we're losing time. Ah, okay. May, may stressed ra. Picked up a temp. Tamboria drum. That's a special drum that they use in Jamaican Republic. 
she started playing the drum while she, we danced. I spun around and around with every drum beat. When I spin in my Golnia dress, my shirt flies up in the air around me. I can see all the colors blend together, and it makes me feel like I'm flying in a rainbow. Okay, class, everyone gather around, instructed Mr. Soto. I'm just going to say teacher because I can not say the same. We stopped spinning to pay attention. We are going to take a break from dancing. I want you to have a seat on the floor. The teacher's son, David, wheeled in a television set on the cart. He's 16 years old and helps his mom out sometimes. We're going to watch the news, Miss Teacher said. I should call her Miss Teacher. My, my eyes look oh, Never mind. The news. We all looked at one another, confused. David turned on the TV, and the news reporter came on. She was doing a new report, news report on dancers. With grace and beauty, these dancers perform what's traditionally known as Japanese flower hat dance. The reporter said, They are one of two local dance groups picked to perform in the Thanksgiving Day Parade this year. We're not allowed. I don't think we're going to be doing that because of COVID and all. So, that's a shame. Reporters were swaying all of the Jack Japanese folk dances. When the report was over, Miss Teacher Soto, Miss Soto turned off the t turned off the TV. Okay, dancers, do you know why I show you this report? She asked. No. We answered all together. Because that reporter, Rachel Chang, is coming here next week to do the new news story on our dance group, La Paloma. All right, I'll show you the picture. Here is the picture. And I'm going to read this part. I don't know. This is page time. We all screamed with excitement. We are going to be on TV on the news. Shakira boarded out. Yes, you are, Miss Soda answered. Soda. We squeered again. And do you know why we're going to be on the news, she asked. We all shook our heads. Because Las Palomas, our dance group, has been asked to perform at the Thanksgiving Day Parade. Sorry. That's my stomach. I'm very, very sorry. My apologies. I, I, I don't know. It does this every day to me. That was it. We all got up and started jumping and screaming and dancing in place. This news was just too exciting. We couldn't sit still. That's what this picture is kind of explaining. All right. Should we read chapter two? Let me see how long it is. Ooh. I don't think we can. Do, 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 do. This video is not sponsored by Domino's. It's just a napkin. It's not sponsored. But I do love Domino's. So. All right, you guys. So that will be our new um, series. I'm going to be doing a playlist about Emma is on the air. Showtime. Alright, so now it's time for some shout outs. And then I got some three things to tell you guys. And I think you guys are going to freak out. Okay. So, our first shout out goes... I forgot her name. I'll tell... I forgot her name. Alright, I'll tell you guys in the next video. But she commented on the my new song. She said, hi, it's me, and stuff like that. I think it was Cheyenne something. I'm so sorry about that. Um, <laughs> so, here's the news. One, if you guys didn't notice, I have short hair. Well, I actually have put things, but I have short hair now. I cut it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, 
No, I have five things. Next, I have... This video is not sponsored by Cincinnati Patriots. Um, this is my team. It even has my name on the back. Yes. Um, I just got on a new travel ball team. For you guys that didn't know, I play softball. I've been playing it for about five or six years now. And, yeah. My third thing is I'm getting spaces next week you guys if you guys don't know what spaces is it's supposed to be something that helps with braces a lot so i will be probably i won't be posting a video on that direct day but i think i'll post it like a day after and a week after that i get braces you guys i'm gonna get braces <laughs> i'm going up so fast and i can't believe it Oh my god. Alright. And the fifth one. We finally have my intro done. Um, I'll show you that. Probably later. I'll post a video on it. Probably. I'll do it right after this video. But it's going to be our intro, you guys. And I'm super happy about it. We haven't had an intro in two months. I think I started this. No, since February. So, yeah. New intro. Alright, you guys. So, now it's time to show you my new intro. Alright. So, this intro is kind of weird. Okay. Just gonna warn you. Jocelyn's Club. <laughs> Is it a house? Is it a raccoon? Is it anything like you? And yeah, that's basically it. I won't be talking in it, but yeah, I'll send a record. All right, this one uh, I have on video, so make sure you check it out. I did this today, and I haven't posted that yet. Jocelyn's Club. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Uh, uh, you might think that I am not. All right, you guys. Rap three. This time, this intro, I'm actually singing in it. So, yeah. Jocelyn's Club! My thing. Is it a house? Is it a raccoon? Is it you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. That is it, you guys. Hey. <laughs> Anyways, I better wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you smash the subscribe. And make sure you smash the like button. I don't care if you turn on notifications. But I'm begging you. And. I'll see y'all next time. Bye. You might be calling me in to the wild.